It's my huge announcer's table. Um, oh gosh. You're kidding me. Hey everybody, Deshaun Rockson back with another video for you guys today. Today I'm going to be doing my WWE 2018 room tour. To begin the year for a good amount of years now, I've done my first video of the year as my room tour. So I'm going to keep it no different. Just added a couple more pieces that I got from Christmas this year and put them in there. And yeah, let me stop rambling and let's get into it. So first when we enter, we just have a lot of these uh, necklaces. And then as we enter, let me just shut this behind me. And then the first thing that you see is the WrestleMania 30 poster Batista. A really cool item in my collection. Cool to have it on the uh, door right there. And then moving on over, we have an R-Truth What's Up autograph. And then the R-Truth figure, What's Up R-Truth autograph. JTG autograph. Chris Jericho autograph. I love this autograph. He personalized it, put Y2J. And then the date, or the year I should say, says 13. And then down here, Ted DiBiase autograph on the WrestleMania Access papers. And then a Sin Cara Elite 15 autograph. Then starting on this wall, you guys have seen these before if you're uh, not new to my channel. We have the WrestleMania 28, my first ever WrestleMania poster. My first ever WrestleMania and WrestleMania poster. Uh, so really cool stuff. Just have a lot of people on there. Big names like Chris Jericho, Dolph Ziggler. Uh, John Cena is on here right there. Mark Henry, Zack Ryder, just a lot of other guys. Daniel Bryan over there. How would I forget the GOAT CM Punk's up there too, right next to John Cena. Then moving on down here, we have my WrestleMania 31 poster. We have Daniel Bryan on here. We have Sting, which is really awesome. We just got a lot of other people. Sin Cara, Dolph Ziggler again, Fernando, Wade Barrett. And then we have the WrestleMania 32 poster from Dallas. We have Neville up there. We have, I know we have Sasha down here somewhere, right, like, right across her face. Sin Cara again, met Sin Cara a lot. And then the final row, we have an El Torito figure signed. This Torito right there. Raw 1000 plaque. The League of Nations plaque from WrestleMania 32. And then a Bailey signed figure right there. Then coming back up, we have a WrestleMania 28 ticket plaque with Shawn Michaels, Triple H, and Undertaker from that Hell in a Cell match. We have the WrestleMania 28 DVD and Daniel Bryan versus Sheamus from WrestleMania 28. Moving back on up, we have a Dolph Ziggler signed picture from when I met him at Ringside Fest. Ringside Fest 2014, signed by Gold Dust. All three members of the Wyatt family signed, Luke Harper, Bray Wyatt, and Eric Rowan. Lana, shut up, <laughs> signed picture. AJ Lee, signed picture. John Cena, signed picture. Ryback, signed picture. Kind of hard to tell there, but Daniel Bryan, signed picture. Kevin Owens, signed picture when I met him at Ringside Fest, as you see by the ticket. Wade Barrett, signed picture. Sin Cara signed picture and X Pac 2 Matt from your friend X Pac Suck It, awesome guy. And then the WrestleMania 32 plaque logo that my dad made. We have a couple of guys on there like Heath Slater, um, Bo Dallas again, I think. Larry Zabisco's on there. The WrestleMania 29 John Cena plaque, number 362 out of 500. Dolph Ziggler stealing the show plaque the night after WrestleMania 29 when he won the world title. Autograph right there. And then the WrestleMania 29 Triple H plaque, autograph right there, number 173 out of 500. So kind of my WrestleMania 29 or after WrestleMania 29 uh, plaque, little wall right there. After that, we have a Rikishi sign picture and a Neville sign picture. And then below those, we have a lot of uh, elites. We have CM Punk signed elite, Kane signed elite, Shawn Michaels signed elite and Brodus Clay signed Elite. Moving back on top, we have the logo plaque that my dad made of Edge, the rated R superstar he put, really cool. And the RVD plaque, uh, Rob Van Dam, five star. Love both these plaques that my dad made, such an amazing job. And then to correspond with it, we have Edge uh, signed picture and Rob Van Dam signed picture. Mick Foley signed picture with, of course, Mr. Sacco signed mark henry survivor series 2011 plaque and a wrestlemania 30 daniel bryan um wins the wwe world heavyweight championship at wrestlemania 30. one of the most badass plaques in my collection i would have to say just because i have it personally signed by all of them it didn't come signed um roman reigns seth rollins and dean ambrose when they all held the wwe world heavyweight championship in the same night at money in the bank 2016 awesome stuff piece of the mat and number 27 out of 199 so really cool number we have a signed picture of the big show autographed to Matt, stay strong, big show. Sasha Banks, the boss, just a picture. And then the boss, New York uh, Empire State license plate sign. Unmatched Fury figure signed by Carlito. And then a picture with Carlito. 
Classic Superstars figure Tony Atlas sign and Mankind sign figure. And coming on down, we have a Rowan sign picture and a Bob Backlund sign picture. Then right here, we have my huge picture of AJ Styles signed when I met him at WrestleMania 33 Access. Amazing. And down here, we have the Montreal Screwjob 2-pack signed by both Bret Hart and Shawn Michaels. Really awesome. And then to this side, we have the WrestleMania 33 logo plaque that my dad made uh, signed by tons of people. Not tons of people, but Sergeant Slaughter. Rhino's on there. I know Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows is on there, so really awesome. Then we're moving back up here. We have the Believe in the Shield plaque signed by all three members again. One of the most amazing plaques that my dad's made. Dean Ambrose, Seth Rollins, and Roman Reigns all signed on there. Um, customized signed uh, Finn Balor plaque from SummerSlam 2016 when he won the Universal title. And then right next to it, we have two Matt Finn Balor elite figure signed. And then up there in the corner is the Seth Rollins Returns plaque from Extreme Rules 2016. I had to get it just because I was there live. So awesome. Hopefully to get it signed one day. Up here, we have the Intercontinental Championship commemorative belt. Rey Mysterio entrance grate signed figure. Mankind signed DVD. Under here, we have a Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Um, two by four and then just a lot of other elite figures you can guys can kind of look at them as i briefly go through them down here is kind of my new day type shelf we have the new day bootios box uh the christmas one the new day regular bootios box and then the new day elite three pack bootios box the wrestlemania 33 program a brodus clay snow ornament and an undertaker uh, ornament down here we have the wrestlemania 33 bear in the plastic couple like three wrestlemania 33 cups Kofi Kingston signed uh, Elite, kind of hard to tell there. The Shield Piggy Bank, another WrestleMania 33 bear, and a couple more figures, Big Show when he was in the NWO, and Umaga, and Shinsuke Nakamura autograph pennant. Amazing piece right here that I got for my birthday um, last year, so 2017 birthday, is the Undertaker. Um, thank you, Undertaker plaque. Not signed or anything, hopefully to get it signed one day. Um, could possibly be his last WrestleMania, so um, I had to get it. Numbered. 92 or no 82 out of 500 and piece of the rope and then right here is one of my four replica titles it is the new day 483 day reign the longest reign in WWE history uh title belt the bootio belt moving on over to here we have a sheamus elite signed figure and then right next to it is the wrestlemania 28 sheamus uh beats daniel bryan in 18 seconds plaque same night we have the undertaker uh end of an era 20 and 0 piece of the mat Triple H, Shawn Michaels, and The Undertaker. Numbered 81 out of 1,000. And next to it, kind of my WrestleMania 28 wall, uh, at least on the top, is my CM Punk uh, defeats Chris Jericho for the WWE title. Kind of hard to tell the signature because he signed it in black, but what you gonna do? And then in the corner, we have the Randy Orton plaque that my dad made, signed by the Viper himself. Back on down here, we have the Gold Dust figure, signed in gold, of course. Right here we have the year of 2014 um, plaque with all of the pay-per-views mats on it, so it's really cool. So you have the Royal Rumble mat, Elimination Chamber, WrestleMania, etc., etc. So you can see all the pay-per-views right there. Just have three pictures, not signed or anything, of Randy Orton, CM Punk, and the game Triple H. Right beneath that we have the 2014 Royal Rumble Batista wins, signed personally by Batista. So I had him sign it personally. Back on down here, we have the WrestleMania 33 uh, official poster signed by a couple of guys like Jinder Mahal's on there. Um, Bo Dallas is right there. I know there's a couple more guys. I'm forgetting Sergeant Slaughter. Moving on over, now we have another AJ Lee signed picture. Santino Cobra signed by Santino. Caitlin signed picture. Shelton Benjamin signed picture. Sheamus signed picture. Just a little uh, ringside fest pennant right there. Then moving back up, we have WrestleMania 33, the Hardy Boys return, signed by them when I met them at SummerSlam this year. So really awesome that I kind of completed it all in one year. Uh, Matt Hardy signed right there, and Jeff Hardy signed all across there. Matt Hardy and Jeff Hardy signed Rob Schamberger picture. Then down here we have a John Cena uh, signed picture and the Bella Twins signed picture. Right here we have a blow up trash can with my Roman Reigns ugly sweater that I just got for Christmas. Hanging from a string is my commemorative Money in the Bank briefcase. And then moving on to this wall we have my Randy Orton signed Night of Champions 2011 commemorative chair 
Uh, my first ever pay-per-view that I went to, signed by Randy Orton, so really, really awesome. WrestleMania 32 commemorative chair, uh, the second time I ever got a commemorative chair from WrestleMania 32. And then, of course, last year, WrestleMania 33 uh, chair. So I have three chairs right now, and then uh, we'll be getting a fourth one when I go to WrestleMania 34, because we are sitting on the floor. Moving back on top, we have the Hell in a Cell match between Shane McMahon and The Undertaker. Crazy spots in that match. Had to get the plaque. Number 41 out of 500. Piece of the uh, trash can, I believe. Daniel Bryan wins the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. One of the greatest moments I've ever seen live. So I had to get this one. Signed by Daniel Bryan right there. Piece of the rope. And number 243 out of 500. Not the best number, but I don't care as long as I have it in my collection, really. We have a huge picture of Triple H signed right there. HHH. A Daniel Bryan elite figure signed. Kind of hard to tell, but it's there. And then a picture of me and Daniel Bryan, not signed or anything, but just a picture of me and him. They're all pins of the different WrestleMania logos, which is really, really awesome. Moving to the side, we have a picture of me and Shelton Benjamin. And down here are two foam fingers, John Cena foam finger and the Fandango foam finger. Moving back up top, we have the Shawn Michaels, huge picture signed by him. And then a WCW wrestlers um, plaque. So it's kind of all trading cards of different superstars of the WCW era. And then down here we have my WWE logo plaque signed by tons of people. Kyle Lee, Seth Rollins is on there, Heath Slater, uh, just a lot of other people. And then this plaque that I just got for Christmas, haven't found a place to put it up yet, but uh, it is the Raw, the Shield reunites. My huge announcers table where I do my videos, usually my tripods over there. Uh, another couple more collectible chairs. And then over here are the three more replica titles that I have. The first one being the WWE World Heavyweight Championship or the WWE Championship, amazing. The Intercontinental, the beautiful Intercontinental white strap title. And then this one that's very, very special is the old classic NXT title signed signed by Samoa Joe, first two-time champ. Really, really awesome that he put it on there. And down here, signed by Shinsuke Nakamura. Kind of hard to tell, but it is there by Shinsuke Nakamura. So amazing piece in my collection. So happy to have it signed by both those guys. This huge WrestleMania um, poster type thing. Um, you know, kind of make it look like a background with all the ropes and the ring posts and stuff like that. My Kofi Kingston stand up, signed by Kofi Kingston himself. And yeah, I think that's about it. So let me just give you guys one brief look overview of everything. So there, there it is. Yeah. Alrighty guys, so that's gonna do it for the video today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment down below. Tell me what your favorite piece in my collection is or what favorite piece you have in your collection is. Let me know down below. And always subscribe if you're new to the channel. Remember to follow me on all social media. The links will be down in the description box below. Definitely go follow me on there. I'm on Twitter most of the time. And then Instagram, you can always follow me on there. I uh, usually post pictures, uh, you know, sometimes. So definitely go check it out and Snapchat, all that good stuff. So hope all of you have a great new year, a happy new year. I will see you guys in the next video. Take care, everyone. Peace.